After last night's Super Bowl, the last thing on the minds of many people was to get up early and head to the gym. But a social media trend has gym goers doing just that and taking an icy plunge. 2822 Sydney Costas explores the benefits behind the trend and tries it out herself. Taking the plunge, but not into a jacuzzi, in an ice bathtub set at 42 degrees. I thought it was going to be a lot worse than it was. Bellio is one of the gym goers trying out the recovery method at Danko's All-American Fitness Gym in Plains. Once I got in, that initial one minute where you really just have to breathe, once you breathe through it, a really a, like a rush of, I guess they say dopamine comes over you and it just warms your body. Taking a dip in an ice bath has been circulating as a recent social media health trend. But is it actually beneficial for your body? Danko's staff says it's an excellent tool for both your physical and mental health. It reduces stress and anxiety, um, mental clarity, you know, just to name a few. It improves your joint and muscle health, all good things. Installing this fitness recovery room just two weeks ago, owner Larry Danko says he had to try it out himself. I was uh, a little skeptical at first, just like I think everybody is, and uh, and it is that first 50 seconds of of adjusting your uh, your body um, and. Once you're in there, uh, it, it's it's bearable. You can you can withstand that five or six minutes. We decided to put it to the test. 2822 sports reporter Nick Zelaya joined in on the fun. It, yeah, that, that, it's Trying it out first. Once adjusted, just minutes in, Nick says he understands why it's popular for recovery. Whether it's playing sports or coming to the gym, working out for an hour or two hours, it's a different method than, you know, some people might like to go in the sauna after a workout and kind of cool down a little bit. Then it was my turn. Feeling pins and needles, but then warmth as your body adjusts. Shivers working their way throughout the minutes. I felt a rush of energy once getting out. Yay, it's cold. So from all of us Monday morning, we're giving the ice bath a thumbs up. Definitely going to do it again. In Plains, Sydney Costas, 2822 News. They are real troopers. Well, the people at Danko's recommend first-time users go in the ice bath for a maximum of five minutes, about two to three times a week.